Welcome back to Run Back to the Nunnery. Welcome back to Vampire the Masquerade Redemption. Redemption indeed. Who comes there? Behold, the great crusader ends his day in retreat. Back for another rest in the nunnery. Between yes, and yes I am. It is better to be wise. Yeah, listen to your pal there. Gonna go get that free, free health. And sell some free, free stuff. Not for free, though. Damn straight. We sell things for money. Actually, I wonder. I think that if you go back... Oh, I think I remember how to level right now. All right, Sir Kristoff. You again. All right, so if we go in here... There's the convent. Hello, Sister Nezka. Oh, bless Sir Christoph, how are you doing today? I'm doing fine, Nezka. Alright. So, what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to put all these into storage. And... Yeah, even these. And there is a method to my madness, folks. Believe it or not, there is. That method, of course, is uh, stinginess. <laughs> because we can sell this for big money. And I know what you're saying. Well, why don't you sell them for big money, you fool? Well, how well you can sell stuff is entirely dependent on... There it is. You have to rest. How well you can sell stuff is entirely dependent on some of your skills. And manipulation affects that. Ah. So we have 655 points. This will cost me 100 to raise it up. And I'm going to raise it up by 5. Now, I'm much more manipulative. <laughs> Give me a better price. <laughs> Pretty much. Basically, it's a haggle skill. Um, that I'm going for here. Oh, shoot. We, uh... We came here to heal. We didn't heal. Oh, sir. I pray that the light of the Lord fill thy body with strength and vigor. Yeah, that's neat. There we go. Yep, all she does is pray for us, and that gives us our health back. Hooray! That's right. You know, it'd be great. Uh, Sister ne could you come down to the mine with me? Oh, I'm afraid I can't leave this convent. I'm okay. a nun, you see. I will protect you from the rats. All you have to do is come with me. I'm afraid I can't come with you, oh dear sir. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I know, I know. And that's good. So I'm a nun. I'm going to hang out down here. I'm afraid I can't come with you, oh dear oh, sir. Oh, shut up, you. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, so... I, uh, I decided to just leave the mine without recording. I figured I would save the... Uh, you, the viewer, some trouble. Yeah, we we really didn't run into anything, and it wasn't much of a wasn't it, much of excitement. So it we was just, just like... backtracking. Honestly, once you kill an enemy in this game, they're pretty much dead. Like I said, they really do uh, limit the amount of XP that you can get. Uh, there are little sneaky ways around some of it, but I mean, outside of just using console commands, but mm -hmm. uh, I'm. Nobody wants to see me use console commands to play this game, trust me. I've always, I've always equated, and I know it, it, this has always come down to like one of those arguments about like, well, what's wrong with cheating? Uh, I don't know, what, what's the point in cheating? I mean... Some people find cheating fun, you don't. Uh, well, that's a, if some people find cheating fun, but it's like one of those deals like, I want to beat the game. I want to know that I beat the game, not just like, well, I cheated, and now I just, I cakewalk the game. There wasn't any skill in it, you know? It's basically, it, to me, it's just like jerking yourself off. Mm. It's, um... Oh, what do we have here? Oh, I could have swore that there was something here. Uh, maybe there's not. Maybe I'm dumb. I have been known to be dumb. We didn't even eat pizza. I know. Ooh, the, the rats might be back. 
There they are. This is one of those sneaky things that you can do to get the uh, a little bit more XP. Not much though. I think those rats aren't worth very much at all. They're rats. Yeah, <laughs> I barely got any XP for that. But it is a little bit of boost of XP. Now you can go around actually killing people in this game. You can pe pe you can kill people in the village, and that will get you some XP. But uh, it also drains your humanity, and if you draw if you drop too low in your humanity in this game, uh, it's instant game over. Ah. Uh. You can't go full chaotic evil. No, you can't. I mean, you can try. You can really ride that line. Mm. In fact, I've done playthroughs where you just do really ride that line. I see. Uh, mainly to get, like, a little bit extra XP. But it's usually not worth it. Because, I mean, the XP that you get from, like, killing town folk just isn't very much. I see. Uh, however, though... There is a place later in the game that you come across where uh, there's guards. And they're very strong guards. And taking them out does get you a pretty good uh -oh. chunk of XP. Yeah, I know, we got two of them on us. Yeah, I hear a rat. Oh, and we are just not being able to hit these guys either. And here comes a rat. <laughs> Yeah, brave, brave Sir Kristoff. He's gonna be dead, Sir Kristoff, if he doesn't fucking start hitting shit. <sighs> well, that was, uh... Not fun. Just a fucking disaster is what that was. On the plus side, I think we are getting close to the bottom of the first map, though. And there is good news, folks, because once you get to certain points in this uh, mine, it does open up other paths that can lead back, and they're kind of like shortcuts. Oh, thank goodness. Yeah, your treasure chest. Oh, I got some rags. Full of rags. Okay. This is actually handy because I have no armor. So it's it's not much armor, but it's, uh, it, it's more than I had. Because they went to the smithy and we were like, you want to buy armor? We're like, we have no money. <laughs> He's all like, hey, you, you're going to need some armor. <laughs> and I'm like, uh, what, what do you got that's cheap? Nothing. Get out of my shop. Go talk to the gypsy. <laughs> and you're like, I don't want to talk to the gypsy. But they're like, gypsies are in the Bible. <laughs> <laughs> so oh, they're shit, like, you got me. Yeah, it's in the Bible, I guess. Down you go. Damn rats are getting between me and my bottle. So yeah, if I focus more on dexterity or something like that, I would be able to hit better. But for me, early game, my biggest focus is trying to get really good manipulation so I can afford the best equipment. Yeah, get the best equipment early in the game so it's, it's less of a struggle later. Oh, ah! Fuck. Rat colony! And yeah, there are some tricks to getting, like, really good... Oh, damn it. There are some tricks to getting, like, the best armor in the game. But... Ah, uh, they're annoying. Ooh. Ah, we're in the mines too now. Electric boogaloo. Actually, in this case, it's silver boogaloo. Ah, <laughs> silver boogaloo. Bond mines level two, silver boogaloo. <laughs> Now, if I'm not mistaken, there's going to be a shit ton of fucking enemies in this room. Well, there's already a rat. Oh, oh there's a slancha. Oh, and this one's got a weapon. Ow! 
Ow. Luckily, he doesn't know how to use said weapon. Ugh, he is tough, though. Ow! Oh, damn it. Die, monster. Oh, Jesus. Yeah, that was a slog. Just fucking barely. Oh, that was... I wonder why there's, like, all those stuff right next to it, because they're like... Oh, this is the uh, this is the health room before the big boss. No, this isn't even before the big boss. Oh, we found a rat. Thank goodness. I reclaim this treasure from the clutches of evil and reconsecrate it to a godly purpose. Thank you for that. Oh yes, a torch. Here's the thing. Do we want the torch? Yeah, for now we want the torch. Yeah, because we need to be able to see. Yeah. It does help. It does come in handy. But we've got to get... We've got to run back to the nunnery. <sighs> hey, nun, I got a torch. <laughs> you know what, folks? We will catch up with you <laughs> once we get back out to the... Back from the nunnery. See you then. Well, there was plenty of dicking around, but we're finally back where we left off. All right, anybody else want to fuck with Sir Kristoff? Oh, I forgot how long of a fucking walk it is to get out of the goddamn mine. All right, we'll throw the we'll throw the shield up. Again, this is a tough call to make because it is handy to have that that torch. Yeah. But, eh, I'd rather have the extra protection from the shield. Okie dokie 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 doke. Alright, what's this way? Ugh. Ooh, someone meeting their grisly fate. Sounds like someone's having a bad day. Hello? Uh, mine security. Oh, rats! Oh, rats running away. Probably telling his friends. Now, this is a thing. If you get out of sight of the enemy, they will regain their morale. So, kill them and kill them quick. Well, no, it's one of those deals where it's like, if they start running away, which is very annoying. Because then you have to track them down to kill them. Um, you, if you just get out of line of sight of them. And then get back in, they'll, they'll come back after you. Of course they will. Just to annoy you. Ooh, that one was extra juicy. Well, no, they'll come back after you is a good thing, because then you can finish them off. Ah. Yet. I forgot about that hole. What did he use? Fortitude? I'm betting fortitude. Because my moves are barely hurting him. There we go. Potence. Oh. Yeah, good thing he couldn't hit us. <laughs> Enough with ye, rats. And another one of these slashed. Yeah, this slachtus. Or slaunches. Now what's in the chest? A healing salve. More rats? Nope. Ah, oh, come on, slatched ya. Mm. Oh, potence again. Yeah, once their head comes off, you know it's going to be a good time. Yeah, because they ain't coming back from decapitation. Nope. Oh, yes. 
This opens up a shortcut to the uh, Silver Mines 1. Nice. So now when we have to go back, and we will, often. Oh, Ow. cool ass rat. Oh, now he's running, you see? Mm -hmm. You see, this is very annoying because he will run and lead you into certain doom. There's actually weapons in the game that can actually cause fear in enemies. Hmm. And uh, those are the worst. <laughs> You're like, I don't want to hurt you. You're like, I want to They're hurt like, I'm going to run away. I'm like, no, come back here so I can kill you. You got the high ground, fool. Oh, cute. You try to bite me. Ow! You didn't have anything good on you. Hell no, he didn't. A disease vaccine. More disease vaccine. So we can fight off the filth fever. <laughs> Oh, I think I remember this room. This is a very bad room. Well, there's a slot show with a weapon, so yeah, that's... Oh, you are annoying. Just die already. Ooh. Ooh. Ow. Eh, it's okay. We hurt him more than he hurt us. There, you see that thing? You just barely see him off in the distance. Yeah, right, that thing. But he's big, and he's angry, and he'll really fuck you up. One more reason to go back to the convent. If we hit that lever, he's definitely going to get us. Yeah. They're all basically worth just about nothing, too. Of course they are. They're rusty. Rust equals weak. Well, this is a dilemma. I don't know if I want to fight this guy or go back to the cob convent. Let's, let's do that. I'd say convent. Yeah. Because we're, we're at less than half health right now. We will do that, and thanks to our new shortcut, this will only take uh, half half of forever. <laughs> but thanks to the miracle of editing... Indeed. Oh, sir, I pray that the light of the Lord fill thy body with strength oh, and vigor. Oh, well, thank you very much. Now we have full health. And we can stop in and do this. Thanks, Anaska. Put away some more daggers and garbage and... Thanks, chest. Some of the crappy uh, health potions. Like I said, these are good weapons, but... God damn, are they... Uh, valuable as hell. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Alright. That should be okay. Yeah, let's level while we're here. See how much more manipulation we can get. All right. M Master manipulator, Sir Kristoff. <laughs> you will heal me, Aneska. <laughs> I was going to do that anyway. And you will do it for free. I already did that anyway. <laughs> Aha! Master Manipulator! And now the long walk back. Oh, you know I'm gonna edit it. Oh, you just knew I was gonna edit it. Yes, you did, but we're back. We are back.
back at the New York Groove. You gotta love it. This editing is great. It does all the grinding so you don't have to. Well, I do all the grinding so you don't have to. All right. Yeah, here comes the water level and here comes the big boss. And we did pull the right lever. Uh, oh shoot, I didn't save. Eh, let's do that real quick. I just... Anytime you fight a boss in this game, it's always a good idea to save because, eh. I don't know if this game has an autosave feature. I'm assuming it doesn't. I don't know. I know that, like, this guy is... There's a good chance he'll kill you. Remember, it's pretty early in the game, so yes. Yeah, that and we haven't been putting anything into any offensive capabilities. Instead, just, like, saving our nickels and dimes and putting everything into manipulation so we can haggle better. There he is. Oh, dear. War ghoul. The war ghoul is a motherfucker. Ow! Like I said. And we're barely doing any damage to him. Oh, there we go. We did a little bit of damage. Oh, we caught him. Oh, here I was bragging him up and, uh... Oh, he got a couple hits on us, He though. did get a few hits on us, to be fair. Oh, damn it. I ran into two slashes. Ow! Yeah, that's what I was afraid. This is what happens when they double-team you. There we go. Well, we're in a good spot now. Is this uh, level ain't over yet? Nah. But that was probably the biggest uh -oh. threat. Oh, the war ghoul? Yeah, the war ghoul is, is pretty rough. Unless I'm forgetting anything. I know the, like, the boss is really tough of this level. Oh, damn it. Did we trigger both of them? Yes, you did. Hopefully we can get a few lucky hits in and kill one before we get to the other. There we go. Ah, two and one. We got a Dirk. Dirk? A Dirk. Dirk McGurk? Dirk, 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 Dirk. Dirk, Dirk, Dirk. It's only 15. It kind of sucks. It's fast, but it sucks. You know what? I'll keep my sword. A bag of gold? Who would leave bag this gold. bag of gold around? Jeez, oh, peace. Well, I'm reclaiming this for the church, obviously. For the church. Yeah, you know, for the tithe. Yeah. Yeah, you know, it's you can't have uh, can't have the house of Lord house of the Lord being like a dingy old uh, shanty or anything. Yeah. Oh, there's something over there. Oh, it's Besides. A the Lord, he spoke to me. He said, get me $5 million by the end of the weekend. $15 million by the end of the weekend. Touch the screen. Touch, Touch the, the screen. screen. <laughs> oh, dear. I All saw right. Shander at. Okay. All right, good. Oh, no. No, there's two slants. Oh, this is bad. Ooh. Come on. Oh, and he blood healed. Alright. Well, they ain't dropping shit for items. Of course they don't. Just to annoy us. Now, you see, if I was doing one of my crazy, uh, min maxi run throughs, I would, uh, I would save every time I got to an enemy, reload, <laughs> and get, make them make sure that they dropped really good items. But we're not, so. But we're not because life is too short. I've done that a few. T I've done that a few times in the Ow. past, and honestly, it sucks all the fun out of the game. <laughs> yes, yes, it does. Oh, we've got weapons. Leather gloves. Leather gloves. I love leather gloves. By the way, they're fun to wear. We got oh, steak. Right. I literally do not like leather gloves, but in the game I do. I like leather gloves in the game and in real life. Behold my leather gloves. 
Now I have better grip on my sword. <laughs> All right, rat, I can hear you. Where the heck are you? Down, down, down. Down, down, down. Down, down. And if you're wondering, down. folks, is there a sewer level in this game? You bet your ass there's a sewer level. There's always a sewer level. Ugh. This ain't it, though, so. No, this is a mines level. Yep. Here you are, cutie pies. Come on out! Ooh! Ow! One got a hit on us. Yeah, we're in danger. Ooh! Ow! Ooh! Uh, back to the nunnery we go. We are in a bad fucking. Ooh, we're in a really bad way. Well, we got ointments. Yeah, we're gonna have to go to the nunnery. See you then. And we're gonna have to get there really, really slowly. This is the danger that comes with. Uh, Running your life so low. Hello, Nunny. Oh, sir, we're back. Goodbye, safety. Nunny. Goodbye, Nun. And we're back in the caves. Hello, mines. Bad rat. Bad rat. God damn it, rat. Well, at least it couldn't hit for shit either. Well. They didn't quite make Poor it. Poor devils couldn't do anything for them. All right, long and winding path. Is there anything down here? I swore there was something. Oh, there's, there's uh, barrels. Barrels. Give me the barrels. Oh, the barrels. disease vaccine. And heal and salve. You know what I'm thinking about? I think I may have done this all wrong. All right, level three. Because I think I don't bother uh, building up Kristoff's manipulation. I think I usually do that for an ancillary character so I can focus on his other two stats. Repair. Whoopsie. 55 lethal, accuracy 25. Uh, 25 lethal. I want it. It does less damage, but it's more accurate. And, uh, it's faster. Well, broadswords are heavy. Yes, they are. But they do more damage because they're heavy. You sacrifice uh, speed for damage. Uh. A whole right, bunch well, of ugly. This is uh, much farther than I thought we would get this episode. Well, okay. So, you know what? What? End of the episode. <laughs> All right. We will pick up on this next time because I don't know if I'm ready for this. I didn't bring any holy water or nothing. All right. Thank you for watching. Thank you for listening. And have a good day, everyone. Have a good day indeed.